Hi, uh, this video tutorial I will cover uh, servlets form data. Uh, here in down you can see the client machine uh, which has browser and right side you can see the server. Server is nothing but a machine which hosts the website. Uh, suppose say this uh, client wants to send uh, some information to the server. Then what client machine uh, browser will do is it will use uh, either get method or post method to send information to the server. Okay. Uh, first we will see the get method. Uh, suppose uh, this uh, client machine browser is using uh, get method to send uh, information to the server. Then what happens is uh, the information which uh, client is passing from uh, client machine to the server machine will be visible in the address bar. Okay, Meaning uh, that uh, information will be appended as part of the uh, page request. So this is a sample. So whatever you are seeing in uh, black color is the page request okay till hello then the question mark is the separator between uh, page request and the information so you can see the information in the red color okay so whatever information you are sending that will be appended to the page request and it will be visible in the address bar okay so if you want to send uh, some password or sensitive information uh, to the server then we should not use uh, get method because uh, suppose if you are sending password or some sensitive information that you can see it in the uh, browser address bar itself. So get method we should not use to send password or sensitive information to the server. Okay. Also uh, get method has size limitation. Only 1024 characters can be in the request uh, string. So more than 1024 characters can't be in the request string. So we cannot send a large amount of uh, data to the server. Okay. And uh, servlet handles this uh, get request using uh, do get method. Okay. Uh, suppose uh, client machine browser is using post method to send information to the server. Then what happens is uh, the information will be sent as part of the message body in the post request. Okay, so the information won't be visible in the address bar because uh, the information won't be appended to the uh, page request uh, like uh, get request. Okay, uh, so only that information will be passed as part of the message body. So if you want to send uh, password or sensitive information to the server, then we should use uh, post method. Okay and get method has uh, size limitation uh, but uh, post method doesn't have a size limitation so if you want to send uh, more data to the server then we should use uh, post method okay and uh, servlet handles uh, the post request using uh, do post method okay uh, here you can see the parameter uh, name and the corresponding value so you can see the name and the value of the parameter name name equal to ROM like that uh, parameter name age corresponding value is uh, 32 and uh, each uh, parameter uh, value pair is uh, separated by ampersand symbol so this name equal to ROM is one parameter value pair and age equal to 32 is another parameter uh, value pair that is separated by ampersand okay and uh, if you want to read uh, this information in the program then uh, we can use uh, four methods uh, which servlet uh, api provides and the first method is uh, get parameter and the second method is uh, get parameter map and third method is uh, get parameter names and uh, fourth and final method is uh, get parameter values okay and using this uh, uh, methods we can uh, uh, read the parameter uh, names and the corresponding uh, values okay and i have created uh, separate uh, uh, videos for uh, how to get this uh, data using the program i have provided some examples uh, so if you want to know more about uh, this uh, servlet form data uh, please log into my channel and uh, watch those videos and uh, this is about uh, servlet form data introduction and thanks for watching bye